Hello guys and welcome back to British Gaming today. Today we are doing our second box of SM10B Sky Legend today. Um, I'm quite happy this has turned up because I've been watching everyone open up their unbroken bonds and I'm quite uh, excited to open up some packs of my own. Even though none of these packs are in, none of these cards are in unbroken bonds, sorry. So it's kind of unique if you've been watching a lot of uh, Unbroken Bonds openings. You know, th this is this is going to be from the next set, I believe, the uh, Unified Minds set. So already, uh, English players getting a sneak peek at what to expect in SM. It would be SM11, wouldn't it? So yes, we've got the uh, beautiful Mitsuhiro Arita artwork. Uh, the three legendary birds, as we've seen. The artwork is 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 very special on this this particular. Uh, pack art and the card and even the box as well. So, let's just close this up. There we go. Some Sky Legend today. Um, last time we did really well with the Plus Japan collaboration. We got uh, two uh, Super Rares uh, out of the box. Actually, one was a Keldeo Hyper Rare and one was a, a Naganadal Full Art. I'm hoping for something a little bit better today. But uh, yeah, uh, the last three boxes we've had, we've had uh, two uh, super rares out of it. So we have been absolutely spoiled with our pulls. Six super rares out of uh, three boxes is really good. Um, I'd like something a little bit more interesting today. Maybe the full art Jesse and James, or maybe um, the glass stained, glass stained? Yeah, the glass stained effect, uh, Legendary Buzz, the alternate art. That box, uh, Moltres and Articuno card, a Silver Valley Hollow card, a U-turn board. Does come as a secret rare that U-turn board. The other secret rare item is Recycle Energy, and then we have a Viridian Forest secret rare uh, Stadium card to be found. Uh, Poipo, uh, uh, forgot your name. Uh, type Noel, and another Hollow card, Frost Lass. A bomber snow there. Oh yeah, I remember I had, I had trouble last time with the uh, <laughs> with the Lake Spirits. I've only just remembered I had that trouble, so I've not actually <laughs> checked. Uh, is it Cherubi or Bound Sweet? One of the two. Uh, Fletch, Fletch something. Hoot Hoot and a Pokemaniac. Does come as a full art trainer. Um, Crustle there. Call me as Crustle. Uh, does come as a full art trainer, that um, Pokemaniac. It's creepy. As I showed you in the last video, the Plaza Japan one, it's, it's a bit creepy. Uh, Dwebble. That Mesprit, Azel for Uxie, one of the three. Uh, Cory Gonagall, and then a another hollow. So three hollows from three packs so far. That's Magnazone here. And then the uh, Day After Tomorrow Blizzard Town uh, card there. So it looks like we're going right to left today. I hope everyone's having uh, a really good sort of uh, Unbroken Bonds release weekend. It seems that the uh, the pulls are quite tricky. What I've seen, that Steeny is amazing with the, with the sky there. There's a few cards like this. Um, uh, there's a Pikachu one in the last set for sure. A circuitry there, Eaton board. Um, yeah, I've seen boxes which just have two two ultra rares in, <laughs> which uh, you know, considering you can get two in one of these Japanese boxes, is great. Uh, Numo, Fletchling, Sozo's uh, Magnemite, and a Keldeo GX. So we start off with a Keldeo GX. Okay, okay. We got Keldeo last time. The only one we were missing was um. Uh, Naganadel. We did actually find both tag team cards, which was great. Always happy to get both the tag team cards. They are the ones I want usually. Uh, the Zapdos, Moltres and Articuno card is probably the one to get in terms of regular GX cards. We have our TR cards to find as well. The Weezing there. Or Dino. Uh, the TR cards um, consist this time of three supporters and one item. That item is Nest Ball, which we got last time, which is good. And, um, I'm oh, sorry, net, net ball, sorry. And the other three are Gladion, Lily, and Lusamine. Uh, Lickitung, uh, Magneton, and an Abomba Snow. And a, a Z Crystal here, which means that a uh, Pokemon with a tackle attack can use that GX attack there. Which means even Rowlet can do it, I think. Have I just nudged this? I don't know. Uh, this artwork is just absolutely stunning. Seems a shame, seems a shame, just tearing into it. <laughs> Some people are more careful, like with the scissors, but there is actually a little uh, incision at the top. Serena, 
and a crustle. There is actually a little incision on the Japanese packs up here. You can, you can see this? Can you see this? There, see that? Yeah, there you go. So it is meant to be pulled down like this. I know people get scissors, but I, I don't have time for scissors. This is, <laughs> you know how underprepared I am for my videos all the time. Imagine if I had to get scissors as well. We have Ordino and uh, Tapu Finny there. It would just be a massive struggle. So, good cards saving themselves so far. This is good, because in our last box we had our TR card and a super rare out before uh, pack three, I think. Or maybe it was in pack three. Blizzard Town, Circuitry. So, um, <laughs> yeah. Luckily we did get another super rare, otherwise that would have been quite a bad showing. Coughing, uh, Fletchling, uh, Steeny, and uh, is that Mesprit? Or Azel for Uxie, it's one of them. <laughs> um, yeah, Hollow Card, and then the Flyinium Z, the only other Z crystal. Is it Wing Attack? I think you need for that one. I'm not sure. I like the concept of the Z crystals anyway. I'm sure they'll bring out the rest of them in the remaining sets. Uh, for Mantis, Hoot Hoot, Ekins, and a Jesse and James Hollow Card. Uh, one of the cards that does, and there's Jesse there with Arbok. And we also got Ekans in that pack, so yeah, very Jesse themed uh, pack, I suppose. Um, yeah, excellent artwork. The full art card is amazing. I really hope I get that card, that'd be nice to get. In terms of pulls that we do want today, um, I think we, we, we want the alternate art Legendary Birds as our top priority. I think that's the same for everyone, really. Backup, backup cards would be the uh, trainer card for the Jesse and James, or the alternate art on the. Um, Rowlet and Alolan Executor, which I'm not sure if I've mentioned yet. Licky Licky, Recycle Energy, does come as a secret rare as well. So yeah, I've got my sleeves here, I'll just put them up there. Because I'm optimistic that we're going to get something good. Hopefully my faith will not be misplaced. Hoot Hoot, just on the second half now. Ekins, uh, Crustle and a Talonflame. There's Jesse and Arbok there as well. I like it when the cards save themselves for the end. It's very good because it means <laughs> nobody's switched off yet. Or maybe you have, I don't know. We have uh, this one again, that Lake Spirit. <laughs> Recycle Energy. I'm not too sure what TR card we're going to want. Hopefully one of the supporters. I don't really mind which one it is as long as it's, it's one of them. Uh, Magneton, uh, Lake Spirit. Licky Licky, Wheezing, and then the Flyinium Z. Hey, we, we, we've not had a many hits for the last uh, few packs. So far we are over halfway through. And we have Keldeo to show for it. So, <laughs> come on, we need, to, we need to sort this out. We need to get our TR card. We've got at least two more GXs to find. And we've got a Super Rare card. So, this should be one heck of a half. Right. A Drooligan. Uh, Magnif. Mag. Mag. Magnif. Might. And a GX card. It's uh, a Alolan uh, Executor and Rowlet. Licky Licky behind it. So I'm glad we got a, a, another tag team card. The tag team of. Uh, well, the unlikely tag team of Rowlet and Alolan Executor. Really nice card. Uh, the alternate art is really nice as well. I have to say, but I'm glad we, we did actually pick up a. Another GX after a little Baron run there. I'd rather the Baron run be at the start of the pack opening than the end, so <laughs> snow run. Uh, is this a Zelf? I feel like that's a Zelf. And a Pokemaniac in the right spot, but not the right rarity. Thankfully, it's not often that I don't really want like a full art trainer. In fact, there's not like too much I do want out of this set, to be honest. But I think, um, yeah, Pokemaniac's just weird. <laughs> And another Jesse and James solo card. I'm not going to complain about doubling up on that one. So two of those Jesse and James. I got two in the last box as well, which actually brings my total to a nice play set of four. Durantis, Snowba, Noctow, Camerupt, and a Crustle. Come on, come on. That's any, <laughs> probably a quarter of the box left, guys. Ekins, uh, Bounce Week. Uh, Hoot Hoot and a Frostlass Hollow card again. So we're racking up the Hollow cards again, but we're not actually getting anything worthwhile so far in this set. I 
I've seen good pulls from this set. I mean, I've done quite well myself recently. Maybe it's because the mask is, is, you know, on our side and he's blessing us with amazing pulls recently. I don't think I'm going to get two super rares out of this box. Hopefully I don't get, um, <laughs> well, firstly, anything I've got already, which is a hyper rare Keldeo or an Aganadel. I'll quite happily accept anything apart from a variation of Naganadel or Keldeo. Last time I got both. <laughs> Um, we have another tag team, I can see here. I don't know if it's going to be a full art yet or not, but hopefully, um, even if it is, it's, that's pretty good. But it should be the legendary birds if not. It is a, it's the alternate art, Alolan Executor and Rowlet. Wow, yes, what a pull we got there. So this is one of the alternate art cards, not like the, the one that everybody wants, the, um, the uh, legendary birds, but it's the, uh, can you see Rowlet just here? Just there? And the Alolan Executor, beautiful. Beautiful card. So we've got an, uh, an alternate art card. They're amazing. Let's put this one in a sleeve. We've done very well with that. We've done very well with that. Got a bit of dust off there. Wow, an, an alternate art card. Only the second alternate art card I've ever pulled in the Tag Team era. The first one was Muck and Alolan Muck. I'm really happy to get that, you know. Um, yeah, it <laughs> could have been a lot worse. I think that's better than the last box where we got two super rares out of, to be honest. So, very happy with that. Um, we still got a few packs. We still got a GX card and a TR card to find in this, uh, in what is um, six, six remaining packs, guys. So we can do this, come on. A TR card. If you didn't know what TI is, it's, it's a reprinted trainer. It's a bomber snow there, oh, and a recycle energy. A reprinted uh, trainer with alternate art. It's a hollow card. You, you're limited, well, not limited. Oh, yeah. It's one per box. Is it here? It's Victini, which isn't not, which isn't not, which is not not our TR card. Down to our last four packs. Hoping for a GX card out of this, guys, and I'm also hoping for a TR card. So hopefully 50% worth of hits in these packs. For Mantis, a Pokemaniac, <laughs> Arbok, three packs left to go. Now hoping for 66% of hits in these two packs. It's going to be 100% after this one, isn't it? Uh, Snova, Ekins, Knockdown, Talonflame, and then uh, Flyanium Z. Two packs left to go. Okay, so we want one GX card. Preferably the legendary birds, and then our TR card. Um, yeah. Now hoping for a hundred percent worth of hits. Let's go. Second to last pack here. We're gonna get a, a GX card or a TR card. We have Lorantis. We have a uh, Fletchin, Fletch, 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 Fletchling, Fletchinda. Hoot hoot, and we did get a TR card. It's Lily, which is possibly the best one to get. I think the Lily. Lily's very popular in Japan. As a lot of you know, that Lily full art card in Japanese is expensive. <laughs> but yeah, Lily with Clefairy here, that's really nice. And camera up there as well. So we're hoping for 100% with the hits. Um, we're one for one so far. This last pack here should hopefully have a GX card inside it. So let's see if this pack artwork is inside this pack. Bounce Week, Numel. Magnemite, and there it is! Yes, the tag team of Zapdos, Articuno, and Moltres. Uh, Talonflame at the back there, finishing off what has been an incredible box this time. We have got the two, um, actually we've got all the same GXs as last time, with the two uh, GX, uh, tag team GX cards. And um, we, got, we did so well with the uh, Super Rare Pool. We got the uh, Alolan, Executor, and Rowlet um, alternate art card. Amazing, really happy with that. And we also got probably the best TR card to get, which was Lily here. We've got Lily there. Amazing, a great box, really happy with that. Can't complain at all. Um, yeah, definitely better than the last box, I think. That alternate art card takes, takes you know, precedence over the, the hyper rare Caldeo and Full Art uh, Naganadel. But yes, that's it today. A great box, thank you for watching. Um, I'm not sure when we'll be back. When we will be back. When we will be back. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I can speak. But yeah, we're going to be back with some uh, Unified Minds, which um, uh, Miracle Twin coming up soon. 
Apart from that, I'm sure we'll find something to do in the meantime. Even if, even if it's a broken bond. <laughs> but yes, thank you for watching, guys. And I'll see you again next time.